heat distortion effect in Blender. Adding a bit of heat distortion can add a lot of realism to your scenes. Hop into your landscape and add a plane. Scale it up and make it perpendicular to your camera. Now make a new material for it. Remove the principal BSDF and add a refraction BSDF node. Now add a noise texture and connect the factor to the color of the refraction node. We can already see some ripples on the screen. Adjust the scale and the detail. You can also include a little distortion if you want. Now add a mapping node to the noise texture and you can stretch it on any one axis for more distortion. You can also make the texture type 4D. Now add a transparent node and mix the two using a mixed shader. I made a mask in an image editor which I'm including for download in the description below. We are going to use this to control the fall off of the heat distortion. Bring the image into Blender and Ctrl Shift click on it to preview it. You can add a color ramp to control the fall off even further. Connect the alpha of the image texture into the color ramp and plug that in into the factor of the mix shader. That gives us a nice fall off. You can add a color ramp between the refraction BSDF and the noise texture if you want to give some colors to your distortion. Animate the scale of the noise texture very slightly to create the rippling effect. And that's how to make heat distortion in Blender. Subscribe for a very special Star Wars themed video this weekend.